flag at Oyster Bay, Long Island, flew at half-mast. A great American was dead. Theodore Roosevelt, the 25th President of the United States, had died quietly in his sleep. The crowd somberly watched his bronze casket being placed in the hearse. Many had braved the snow and cold to pay their final respects to Colonel Teddy. The man who all his life had solemnly preached the wisdom of speaking softly and carrying a big stick now was taking part in his last parade.